nitpick. Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Pokemon. Um, as you can see, we are back in Lavender Town right now. I know at the end of the last episode we were not here. I think I ended it in Celadon City. But, um, I got the Sylph Scope, if you remember from the last episode, and we are going to use the Sylph Scope in the Pokemon Tower, which I, I think that's what this is called, right? It's been a while, guys. I, let me read the sign real fast. May the souls of, of Pokemon rest easy. Pokemon Tower. Yep, that's what I thought. Okay. One thing I want to show you before I go into Pokemon Tower is I've been doing a little bit of training off screen. It's actually been a few days since I played. So we have Spanky level 39, Dwayne level 39, Shaney level 39, and Doug Trio and Shroomy are still the same because I'm not really going to train them. As soon as I can get a Pokemon to replace Doug Trio, which I think I know what the next one's going to be, he's out of here. He is gone. He's, he's ancient history. But, um,. We have Laharl here, who is level 35, and I didn't want to train Laharl because I wanted you guys to see him evolve. Um, I, I realized that I had robbed you of uh, seeing Geodudes ev evolve into um, Graveler, and I wanted to remedy that. So uh, Laharl is first in the party, and is probably going to be first in the party, hopefully throughout this entire little adventure of us going through the Pokemon. Oh, balls, I totally forgot about this. Um, that's Gary. Let's talk to him. Oh yeah, Nagger, Nagger, <laughs> dude, I totally forgot his name. <laughs> hey, Nitpick, what brings you here? Your Pokemon don't look dead. I can at least make them faint. Let's go, pal. Pal? Wow. Actually being kind of a sweet guy. Being kind of a sweet little boy. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Okay, so he sends out Firo. Wow, a freaking Firo. Well, it's level, tw it's level 25, though. It's pretty pathetic. I probably should be able to two-hit KO it. I don't think I'm going to be able to one-hit KO it with Slash. Yeah, it was pretty dang close, but, um, and I might as well, I'm probably gonna be using Slash, um, a lot, as much as I can in here, because a lot of the trainers in here have Ghost Pokemon, and the thing with Ghost Pokemon is, um, let's Slash this, let's Slash this thing too, hopefully I can one-hit KO the Magnemite, they, the Magnemites aren't that good, yeah, there we go, um, but a lot of the Pokemon that people use in this, in this, in the Pokemon Tower are, uh, Ghost types. Shelter! I can kill Shelter. I can one hit. Well, Shelter has good defense. It might take two. I don't know though. Yeah, I was gonna say he's only level 22. It's pretty pathetic. I'm over 10 levels ahead of that beast. Okay. And we have a Sandshrew, who I'm going to slash, which is ironic because Sandshrew's evolution is Sand Slash. <laughs> okay, so Sandshrew's dead. Moving on from Sandshrew. Oh, 36. You guys are gonna get to witness it. Do I learn any moves at 36? Apparently not. And he has an Eevee. Which, by the way, I believe at the end of the game, Eevee gets evolved into a... Actually, I'm not exactly sure what he evolves his Eevee into. It's been a long freaking time since I've actually beaten this game. I beat, I beat it, a, I played it a bunch as a kid, but... What, you stinker? I took it easy on you, too. What? The Harl is evolving. This is for you, Zach. This evolution is for you, my friend. <laughs> okay, so, um... The Harlkins... Pokemon has now evolved new Charizard, which Charizard looks like a freaking beast in this game. It's completely understandable why people liked him so much. How's your Pokemon coming, pal? I just caught a Cubone. I can't find the grown-up Marowak yet. I doubt there are any left. Well, I better get going. I've got a lot to accomplish, pal. Smell you later. Oh, gosh. Nitpick smells so bad he hasn't showered in days. Okay, so we're done with Gary now, and uh, that means that Laharl, as you can see, Laharl didn't lose anything at all. He's got 112 health. He's pretty much freaking set to go. Oh gosh, dang, going the wrong way already. This is not going to be good. <laughs> this is a bad sign. Uh, in this episode, we're going to go all the way through Pokemon Tower, by the way. So if you guys, hello, even we could not identify the Wayward Ghosts. A Sylph Scope might be able to unmask them, and that's them literally saying, "Hey, by the way, go find the Sylph Scope." Which, by the way can be extremely difficult to do, especially if you're a kid playing through this game and you have no idea where you... Oh, wow! First encounter! Okay. So, a Sylph Scope, normally you'd be seeing just a ghost type. I just It would just show this crappy ghost. Actually, if you want an example of that crappy ghost, you can watch my Ninja Bread Man review on uh, my main channel. Let's see if I can capture this thing. Oh, my. He is not messing around. Come on, baby, don't hurt yourself. Of course he would do that as soon as I ask him not to. Oh, yeah, yeah, don't, oh, don't do, oh, don't get paralyzed. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> okay, so he's close to being dead. He's gonna keep using Confusory. That's good. Let's get rid of all these Pokeballs. I'm sure I'm probably if I even catch him, I'm gonna freaking be using like all of them. No way! <laughs> oh. Finding Haunter in here is like finding Doug Trio in Diglett's Cave. It's pretty rare. 
but it's awesome. By licking, it saps the victim's life. It causes shaking that won't stop until the victim's demise. Oh my goodness. <coughs> Excuse me, sorry, I got some in my throat. Do you want to get a name to ha nickname to Haunter? No, but if you guys want me to give him a nickname, let me know. I have tons of Pokemon. I think if a lot of you haven't asked or I haven't given nicknames to a lot of the Pokemon, Kikiki Kwa! If I haven't given nicknames to a lot of the Pokemon by the end, well, at least close to the end of the series, I'm going to uh, go through my PC and name off all the Pokemon that I have, and you guys can choose them, or I'll just choose them for you. But I want I want to nickname it. I want to nickname everybody. It's something I want to do. Okay, so we're gonna use Ember, which oh come on, oh even a critical hit it didn't kill it. He's getting so paralyzed. Oh my gosh, I freaking knew it. <sighs> See if Charizard. Oh my goodness. Oh yeah, right, right, right. I forgot Nightshade does damage equal to the Pokemon's level. It's so stupid. And that's like, hmm, what am I doing? I don't know. You're battling me. What do you freaking think you're doing? Let's get him unparalyzed because that's going to be a super huge issue. And you know what? I'm going to use a potion on him too because I need to get rid of those. You got a potion. Yeah, yeah. Because they only heal 20 HP and now my Pokemon's HP, well, except for Shaney. Because you can't evolve Pikachu in this damn game. Um, except for him, everybody's getting over 100 HP now. Be gone, evil spirit! Alright. See ya. <laughs> Just, like, leave the Pokemon Tower. Bye! <laughs> okay, so Chandler wants to fight. Chandler sent out Ghastly. Another Ghastly. Which, unfortunately, is probably gonna take me two hits to kill. Which is a freaking huge pain. Yeah, and it's gonna use, like... Oh, okay, it's using Nightshade. Like, and it's gonna use Lick, and then I'm gonna get paralyzed. <sighs> I hate moves like Nightshade and Sonic Boom that do that fixed damage, especially when you're going through, like, the game, you know, itself. Woo! The spirit, what, the spirit fled? Is that what she said? Um, if I catch, if I run into a Ghastly, holy crap! How am I getting this? I'm not gonna, oh, it's only level 20. Hmm. I'm not gonna fight it. But if I run into a Ghastly and I catch that, I'm going to go ahead and use, uh, the Repel. Is there an item up here? Ooh, there's a lady up here. Let's see what she wants. But yeah, not until I run into Ghastly, and hopefully I can catch that thing. Oh, there is an item up here. Okay, good. See, I think um, the spirits of all the dead Pokemon, this might sound crazy, I think the spirits of all the dead Pokemon are possessing a lot of the people in this game, which is insane. <laughs> That's freaking crazy. It's crazy to think about that, because, you know, when you think of Pokemon, you don't think of, like, oh my gosh, dark and mysterious, which, by the way, that's one thing that I want them to do really, really bad is actually make a Pokemon game that has like a really dark and depressing story. Um, I think that'd be cool. Obviously, they'll probably never do that since this game is supposed to be for kids or whatever, even though Black and White had a pretty... No, not Black. Was it Black and White? Oh, an escape rope? Are you freaking joking? What a joke! What a freaking... How am I running into Haunters on this level? This is freaking insane! <sighs> okay. I am done freaking running into Haunters, man. I'm probably watch me like not run into another one now. I don't really care. I don't just don't. It's not my prerogative to keep freaking fighting Haunters. Okay, so we're moving on to the next level here. Oh boy, <laughs> this place is freaking littered with these things. Be cursed with me. <laughs> Why would I want to be cursed with you? Or is it like some kind of song, some kind of pop song that's really popular in the Pokemon era? Be cursed with me. You know you want to, baby. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> All right. Okay, so we're going to use Ember on the Ghastly. And that's not going to kill him. Of course, he's going to use Confuse Rate. This is the most annoying part of going through this tower, is that they keep using Lick and Confuse Rate on you. Lick has a chance of paralyzing you. And can, you know what? Forget this. Oh, my gosh. If I brought out Dwayne... It, oh yeah, by the way, something I didn't I didn't tell you guys, I forgot to tell you. Uh, Dwayne learned a very awesome move called Earthquake. Which, by the way, since Ghastly and, um... Since Ghastly, you know, Haunter and Gengar, they don't have the, the abilities, like, such as Levitate in this game, Earthquake annihilates. Any ground move annihilates those guys, because they don't have very good defense. What?! <laughs> Alright. Nipik found Elixir. I think Elixir is spelled wrong. I think Elixir is actually spelled with an I. That's kind of weird. Let's use another potion on Laharl. There is a, like a midway point partway through this uh, area where you can heal up. I know you can. Awakening. Oh. That's the very thing I don't need in this area. I don't need a freaking Awakening. I need a Paralyze Heal and I need uh, something to heal Confusion. 
Which, by the way, I don't know if they have that in this game. I don't know if they have something that heals confusion in this game. That's how old this freaking game is, dude. Crazy. What, does she have like a haunter or something? Oh, she has a cast leak. You're gonna be hearing that sound a lot, ladies and gentlemen. You're gonna be hearing it a lot. One thing I really wish that they, they'd do, and I think I've talked about this before, I think this was, it was in my... I think I talked about this in my episodes when I was still in Cerulean City, you know, where the second gym is. One thing that really bothers me is that, like, you know, you have the Pokemon TV show, right? Um, where they have... All, they, all the Pokemon have voices, like, they say their names, they're like, Pika Pika, and stuff like that, like, they actually say their names, like, Babasar, like, they say their actual names because that's how Pokemon actually talk, because they can't talk. And I really wish that, like, in these games, I might be able to catch a Ghastly. To catch a Ghastly. Yeah, I, I, I'll, I'll see if I can catch him. Uh, better hurry up and catch him, too, because uh, he's gonna keep using. If he keeps using Nightshade on me, that's not gonna be a pretty day for poor old Charizard. Come on, baby. There we go! We got a Ghastly! So now I can freaking start using Repels, and all this annoying crap can go away. Let's see what the Pokedex has to say about Ghastly. Said to appear in decrepit, deserted buildings. It has no real shape, as it appears to be made of a gas. Gas? Flea. Huh. Are you named Ghastly? No, not really. But if you guys want me to nickname you after Ghastly, let me know in the comments section. Okay. HP up. Oh, this is good. This is good. I like HP up. I like HP up. Uh, where's it at? I need to start using some of these items, because uh, I have very limited item space, I found out. <laughs> I didn't know the item space was so freaking limited in this game. You know, let's use HP up on the Harl. I've been using a lot of stuff on the Harl. Oh yeah, let's use a potion on the Harl too. Because while I'm in the menu, I might as well. Um, especially considering the fact that I'm in the menu and I'm about to freaking chuck on this repel. Where's it at? Where's it at? Yeah, boy, give me that. Nitpick, use repel. Thank freaking god. Every All these encounters were getting really annoying. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> oh, I just right after I use my potions too. Okay. So here we go. We got we got another we got another lady or channel or whatever. You shall join us. Join us in what? We're, oh, we're all going to McDonald's. So I just just figured I'd throw it in about your way. Oh, thank you, thank you. I do appreciate that. <laughs> so we have another level twenty-ish ghastly. <laughs> Again, you're going to be seeing this a lot in this tower. So hope you guys like to hear that sound. Oh my gosh, here we go. 22, 22 instant damage. Freaking huge pain. Because see, moves like that make it to where, like, it, oh, it doesn't matter how much you train your Pokemon, because it's just going to do the same amount of damage each time. What a nightmare. Yeah, so every time, apparently every time I freaking stomp the crap out of these losers, they, uh... There we go. Give me your... Oh, wow, let's see. That's some serious stuff you're talking about there. I'm sorry, that's not something that I, that I can just do. Okay, so we got a... Ooh, she's got a Haunter. Oh, this will be a lot of fun. Let me guess, it's gonna use freaking Confuse Ray on me, and then I'm gonna rage. Oh, yes! It did use Confuse Ray on me! You gotta be kidding me. Don't hurt yourself, please. God! Every time I say it, every time I say it, he hurts himself. Molly, see, I told. Oh, watch. Oh, man. See, that'd be the worst thing. Oh, oh, Charizard! Charizard ain't here right now! <laughs> Ooh, level 37 now. Very good. Learn some freaking moves already. Learn Flamethrower or something. Gasp! Oh my goodness, did I just tell you that I wanted your soul? Okay, this by the way, entered purified z purified protected zone. Nitpicks Pokemon are fully healed. Okay, and that lady that's standing right there next to the purified protected zone, she's not a battle. She just says, oh, here, come over here to be healed, pretty much is what she says. So, And I want to move on as fast as I can. I'm not trying to rush through it, it's just, um, repel only lasts a certain amount of steps. If you guys didn't know that. I don't know if I've even said that before. <laughs> Johnny Nitpick not giving you all the information you need to know, huh? Oh, critical hit. Very good, very good. I think those are our only Pokemon, too. Oh, thank you. Huh? What? Huh? I'm not sure. Is that a joke or is it not? Ooh, a nugget. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, nuggy. Erg, erf. <laughs> it's like I'm freaking reading a Garfield comic or something. Okay, so she's going to throw out a... Oh, not a ghastly. These haunters are... Really freaking huge pain in the butt. Oh well, I'll kill it in a few hits. Oh, oh my goodness. Please, like, kill it in like two. That would be so amazing if you just killed it in two. Oh, thank you, Charizard. I'm glad you obey me, unlike Ash's Charizard. <laughs> Woo! By the way, you know what? That's gonna be the question of the day. <laughs> 
What's your favorite Pokemon from the TV show? What's your favorite Pokemon from the TV show? Oh, there's an item down there. Give me blood. Oh, jeez. These ladies are just getting worse. Ah, eh, never mind. The last one asked me asked for me, me for my soul, so I guess that's not really that bad. Oh man, I'm not gonna be able to one hit KO any of these th these things, so they're just gonna be able to nightshade me all freaking day long. Oh, and they're gonna do it. Oh my goodness, I'm like predicting everything that's happening in this game. <laughs> I think all the I think all Ghastly has at that level is nightshade and lick, so. Because I don't think he learns Confuse Ray until level 25. But if you catch a Haunter, I like I have no idea. I have no idea what I'm talking about. I'm being an idiot. But I think I'm pretty sure if you catch a Haunter, though, Haunter comes with Confuse Ray. Because Confuse Ray is a move that Haunter learns from the beginning or whatever. I don't know. Whatever. Anyways, this is at least halfway decent experience. So I mean, like, I'm, it's not that big of a pain. I mean, it's a super huge pain that, like, by the way, after this battle, I'm gonna have to potion the crap out of Charizard which is seriously a huge pain and really annoying. But you know, what can you do? I guess you can try to not fight these idiots, but the only problem is, like, I want to get all these items. <laughs> X... Oh my God. Mm, when they give you that kind of stuff, man, it's like, I feel like I'm getting, like, slapped in the face. It's like, use your X, <laughs> X accuracy, idiot. Like, oh, thanks. Yeah, instead of instead of using uh, like all my potions, I'm going to enter the purified protection zone. Uh, by the way, in the in the purified protection zone, you it, there's two reasons why it's called that. For one, all your Pokemon get healed, and for two, um, you can't run into battles in there. <laughs> That's so weird. I've never heard someone laugh like that. So every time like I hear like the words like ki ki ki, I always think it's like odd that they that they chose to use the hat. Charizard, when does Charizard learn Flamethrower? Ooh, he got burned. This will probably paralyze me or some crap. Oh, it didn't. Hurt by the burn. Good. Burn, baby. Burn. Burn. Moving on. I like how she has one Ghastly and the last lady had freaking three. What a buttload of shit. Okay, uh... Nothing over there, so here we go. We got ourselves another battle, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, what's she got? What's she got? What's she got? Oh, what's she got a Haunter? Oh, she got a Ghastly too. What is up with this? They're so random. Like you think you think as you go up the tower or something like that that they would just have like better and better Pokemon, but like that's not even the case. Oh, I hate Lick so much, especially with that freaking chance of paralysis, man. It's so bunk. I have a feeling Charizard's gonna level up again here soon, though. Something fell out. Oh, what? What are you saying? Oh, this is a required item. I have to get this item. Oh crap! I forgot to use another repel. No, uh, it shouldn't be that much of an issue. I think I'm getting close to the end of the tower now. I think. I could be wrong. What is this? Nipic found a rare candy. Ooh, sexy. Oh, Johnny likes. I am. Okay, so we're we're gonna save it up right here just in case. Um. And in fact, I'm going to switch out my Pokemon really fast after I save this, because we're about to run into a, a mandatory battle with, let's see, um, let's switch in Spanky. Spanky will freaking, Spanky is going to freaking annihilate this thing. Be gone, intruders. Okay, <clears throat> so what we're about to fight, it says, this is, oh, this is what ghosts would normally look like, by the way, if you don't have the Sylph scope, but I do have the Sylph scope, so, ghost appeared. Sylph scope unveiled the ghost's identity. And there we go. We have a Marowak. Which, by the way, unfortunately, you can't catch this thing. So, if you're wondering, oh, dude, you should totally freaking get that Marowak, and then you can train it, man. That's what that's, that's the Pokemon that I want. Unfortunately, we're going to have to find a Marowak or a Cubone somewhere else, which I'm, I'm not sure actually where you find those in this game. Okay, this thing is so freaking dead. See, actually, here, I'll show you. Since, since uh... See, the Pokemon... Oh, the Pokemon box is full? What a joke! Okay, so I guess I can't show you. I was going to show you, but when you throw the Pokeball at it, it, like, it, like, thwaps it away. It whaps it away with its bone. 531. The ghost was the restless soul of Cubone's mother. The mother's soul was calmed. It departed to the afterlife. There we go. So, um, you can read all about that online if you want to, like the Kibo. Oh, stop right there. I totally forgot about this. Gramps here wanted to complain, so we're settling him straight. We're setting him straight. Mm -hmm. Surrender yourself invisible or prepare to fight. 
Well, you guys didn't give me much time. I was about to render myself invisible, you know, use Wind Walk or something like that, but uh, you just you didn't let me. Okay, so we got a Meowth. And Spanky is going to completely freaking annihilate this thing with Low Kick. He's going to say, even if Low Kick doesn't hit, like, this, that thing is not that high of a level. Okay, but <clears throat> what we need to do is switch back in Charizard. Oh, they have an Arbok now. Crap, it's getting real. It's getting real up in this his house. So what we're going to do is use Slash. Goodbye. Goodbye. Oh, I just had this. Oh, no. Oh, man, that is a bunch of crap. Okay, Charizard's paralyzed. I, unfortunately, by the way, have a really... I'm, you know, I'm sure everybody would say this, but I have a really, really bad luck with... Uh, ooh, yeah, there we go. Laharl. Laharl levels up. Ooh, and a Weezing. I wonder if I can two-hit KO this thing with Slash. I know Weezing has pretty good defenses, but let's find out. Um, Here we go. Ooh, not bad. I can two-hit KO it. So even if I even if I miss here, uh, yeah, I was gonna say even if I miss or if I get fully paralyzed, then uh, I'll still kill him when I hit him next time. But yeah, I have the worst luck with like confusion, as you've probably seen throughout this. I have the worst luck with freaking confusion. That's probably the, that's probably the move that I hate the most is when you get confused. You will regret this. I actually have a friend that um, looks like Team Rocket's blasting off again. Goodbye. Now, normally in red and blue, there would be a line of Team Rocket members leading up to uh, the area where we're going to right now. But in yellow, you just fight Team Rocket right there, obviously from the TV show. And um, that's it. It's the end. And here we are. Yeah, you came to save me? Thank you. I came here of my own free will. I came to calm the soul of Cubone's mother. I think Marowak's spirit has gone to the afterlife. I must thank you for your kind concern. Follow me to my home, Pokemon House, at the foot of this tower. Oh, man. Oh! I was like, gonna say, please don't let me go all the way back through that. I would freaking kill you, Mr. Fuji. Nitpick. Your Pokemon quest may fail without love for your Pokemon. I think this may help you on your quest. The Pokemon Flute, ladies and gentlemen. Upon hearing Poke Flute, sleeping Pokemon will spring awake. It works on all sleeping Pokemon. Okay. So we're going to be using the Pokey Flute just a little bit later, but this is going to be the end of the episode today, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much for watching, by the way. And your question of the day is, what was your favorite Pokemon from the Pokemon TV show? You know, the one with Ash Ketchum and Gary Oak and all that, and Misty and Brock and all that. But let me know what your favorite Pokemon is from the Pokemon TV show. I will be, uh, I, I think, I think mine... I think mine was probably Squirtle, because he's like such a badass with like the glasses and all that. He was probably my favorite character. But let me know what yours is from the Pokemon TV show. Maybe you like Charizard, maybe you like Pikachu, maybe you like Bulbasaur, whatever. Let me know what it is in the comment section below, and I will be happy to hear what you guys have to say, and I will see you soon.